Hello students. Now in the last class, you have learned the neutralization process between an acid and a base, right? That gives salt and water. This neutralization process takes place. Now you have learned this in ant bite and soil treatment and in the factory base. In the last class, we have learned all this. Now I want you to know some acids are present in few substances that we will Now, now we will uh, we'll learn all this now. See, now in vinegar, which acid is present in vinegar? Acetic acid. Now, in the ant's sting, see when an ant bites, you know, ant bites, we feel much pain. So, because of the acid, formic acid present in the ant. So, formic acid is present in the ant's sting. Now, citric acid is present in the citrus fruits such as oranges, lemons, etc. Lactic acid is present in the curd which helps in converting into milk into curd. Oxalic acid is present in the vegetable spinach. Asc ascorbic acid or vitamin C is present in amla. Amla that is nalikai. Citrus fruits like tomatoes, berries. Now tartaric acid is present in tamarind. Tamarind grapes and unripe mangoes etc now these are the uh, these are certain acids present in these substances now these are the bases present in these substances calcium hydroxide calcium hydroxide is present in lime water lime water ammonium hydroxide is present in window cleaner so window cleaner what are the things we use for window cleaner choline like soap oil, we clean the window, the sorry, the dirt. So the ammonium hydroxide, that is a base present in window cleaner. So soaps, soaps con contains the base, contain the base sodium or potassium hydroxide, and magnesium hydroxide, the base present in milk of magnesia. Yes, magnesium hydroxide, that is base present in milk of magnesia, that is. We take milk of magnesia that is a base to reduce the effect of acidity in the stomach. Right? I have explained that earlier. Now, let's summarize the lesson acids, bases and salts. Now, what all we have learnt? Acids. So, what are acids? Acids are the substances that are sour in taste and that contains hydrogen positive ions. Bases are the substances that are bitter in taste and they are they contain hydroxyl ions, OH ions. Now, what are indicators? Indicators are the solutions of substances that show different colors in acidic, basic and neutral solutions. Indicators. So, we learnt about neutralization reaction between acid and base. So, neutralization reaction forms a new substance called the salt and water along with the evolution of heat. So, how the neutralization reaction takes place in everyday life. So where we have seen in the digestion, pro, sorry, in the stomach, if we have more acidity in the stomach, it is neutralized by adding a basic solution that is milk of magnesia to form salt and water. The effect of acid is reduced in the stomach. Now, and one more in the ant, if an ant bites, if an ant bites, it is the effect of acid is reduced by adding by rubbing moist baking soda that is a base or applying calamine solution also and soil treatment if a soil is acidic or basic in nature it's neutralized by adding acids or it is neutralized by adding base and in the factory wastes factory wastes usually have more acids so they are being neutralized by adding bases before releasing to the ponds and water bodies. So, these are all the uh, things we have learned. Neutralization reaction in everyday life. Now, different acids and bases present in substances used in everyday life also. I gave the list. Now, that's all. Now, I want you to do an activity using the knowledge of acids and bases, right? Now, I'll send it through the WhatsApp, children. 
Now you can do that activity when I give it in the WhatsApp group. Now let's end up the session here. Thank you.